welcome to my channel, The Navajo Mama. It's so great to have you guys here today. Oh, sorry. <laughs> today is Sunday and um, my hair is looking a mess. Uh, oh my gosh, I have so many things to do. Um, oh. <laughs> okay, anyways, today's vlog is just an update. Um, it's a Sunday chat with me update vlog. And really, I hope you guys are having a great Sunday because this is like the last rest day before the week comes. And I hope you guys have an amazing week. Today has been pretty gloomy outside, very um, cloudy. I think there's it's going to rain, continue to rain because it's been raining for the earlier part of today. Um, occasionally, you'll see my littles. Okay, so for an introduction... Hey guys, if you're a new subscriber, um, sorry, I just, yeah, subscribe. But hey, if you're new to my channel, my name is Sarah. I am a stay-at-home mom of five. We homeschool. I'm Navajo. My whole family is Navajo. And we do our channel full of vlogs. It's basically a perspective from a Navajo woman's perspective. And that's all things mom, all things wife, all things life. I totally forgot baby was sleeping. Baby was sleeping with okay. nap. So I totally forgot baby was sleeping with his nap. Yeah, okay. So today is Sunday. We had a whole bunch of things we did today. I'm in the middle of doing laundry. I have a lot of other stuff I'm doing. Um, I'm actually getting ready to, yeah. I, oh, no, no, not yet. Wait. Um, I'm actually getting ready to fill out my calendar for the week. Um, we have several things coming up. I want to fill in our calendar for like our work stuff. Sorry. Our work stuff. Um, homeschool. Everything. Just everything in life. Um, so I am so excited. And if you don't know me like personally, I love planning, I love listing, I love organization, I'm all things planner and stuff like that. So it's welcome to my life. <laughs> Today I am doing laundry, doing a bunch of, a little bit of organizational stuff around the house. Uh, babe's not here, my husband left, he's actually going to go meet up with his, um, I don't know, what do you call it at this age? I don't want to say his guy friends, because, like, we're not at that season. Um, but then again, I don't want to say his man friends. I don't know, with his friends. <laughs> Sorry, babe, if you're watching this. Anyways, he went and met up with his friends. They're going golfing. And yes, they are being cautious. And yes, there's a pandemic. And yes, it's cold, cold, cold. But... I believe that he needs his own time too. Just as much as like yesterday, I went on a date with my great girlfriends and we had dinner and we were able to just sit down and talk about life and everything. So it was really sweet. Hi, baby. It was so sweet. Hi, honey. Do you like your animal crackers? Yeah. I yeah. She's so sweet. I cannot believe she's three. <laughs> We're just messy hair right now. I can't even believe I'm vlogging this and gonna put it out. My hair's a wreck. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, yes. Babe went out and he's golfing, gonna have dinner and get recharged up and just enjoy his friends, you know. And I really love this because my girlfriends I went out to dinner with their husbands are also my husband's friends so it's like it's a knit that i i prayed for something like this like my entire life and now that we have this it's such a blessing so i'm also so encouraged that i could i don't know that my husband gets to go out and have these times i really 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 love that i am all about hey we're married but you know and we have these roles in life but it's also good to have something for yourself. I really love that. Okay, anyways, enough of that. Um, they're out doing that, I'm here. Um, it's been a really, really great comfy afternoon. We've been doing cuddles and reading books and it's like raining outside. I'm gonna show you a little bit of what that looked like. It slowed down a little, so. But it's been very chilly. And if you don't know me, 
I love summers and like triple digit weather. So anything lower than literally like 77, anything lower than that is cold to me. Like I freeze. Um, yeah, and here I went to school in Michigan for college, like for university. I don't even know how I survived that because that was so cold. And then we used to live in the East Coast, like our little family unit. We used to live in the East Coast and that alone was also crazy. Um, really? So we're totally enjoying um, our Sunday. I'm ready to just, you know, get down, get a good book, cuddle, and just, um, just read. That's one of the things I love to do. What do you guys like to do? A lot of my hobbies are more like reading, um, gardening, organizing. Guys, this is so sweet. The dress she has on, she loves it because it has a tutu to it. And she thinks it's frozen, but it's Harry Potter. <laughs> I'm like, sorry, baby girl. Um, and then she loves these cute girl scrunchies. I'm like, so cute. Um, mm -hmm. Hey guys, they're just walking around in their sweaters. Hello. Hi. 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 What are you guys doing? Daddy shot a toy. I'm pretending to be someone else. Oh. Someone else by someone. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm making him invisible. Daddy. Is that why Daddy. you're wearing a nice sweater? Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. 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 Dadd
Yeah, she's so pretty. There you go. She's so sweet. Um, yeah, so I want to get back to those emails. Uh, I just took the last week and a half to really recharge, go to some appointments. I have another, um, I have another uh, MRI scan coming up. Um, that's all a part of my lupus journey. And um, yeah, life has just really been tugging. So I've been taking some moments to recharge and cuddle with my family and it's been really good. So I'm going to get back to those emails. Please do comment, say hey, because I love saying hi to you individually. Sorry, let me fix this here. You know, okay, let's, um, so they're playing hide and seek and I have to help um, count Koei two, count, so count, hold on. Count two, ten. Okay, let's count to ten. Look at me. One, two, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here he comes. Okay, um, so yeah, I'm going to get back to those emails. Oh my gosh, that scared me. Um, yeah, so between, you know, grieving, um, everything else, it's just been a hard couple, I don't know, I want to say, I don't want to say hard, it's just been life, and I, I wanted to update you all, let you know that, you know, just kind of let you know what's new with us, what we're going through, in case any of you guys are going through something similar, I really encourage you to, um, journal it talk about it just to process it um so it's okay like i'm here if you want to talk we haven't been out to any parks or anything just because the numbers of the virus have been going up and i know there's lots of people out there who don't believe in this virus who think it's a hoax and that masking up is not real and there's like an agenda or something and i totally respect your views totally respect it but I want to take it with a grain of salt and I want to be cautious. And I know there are many people who say, like, if you believe in God, you shouldn't be scared. But you know what? I believe in God. But I also believe that God gives us, um, I don't know, common sense and um, the mind to have discernment. To be like, hey, you know what? If there's something I can do to kind of limit someone else getting sick, I'm gonna do that. So that's kind of what we're doing. Not saying that's anything about you guys. No, 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 not judging you, just saying about me. Um, so for my family, we talk about it. My husband and I were like, how do we move forward? What do we do? And right now we are looking for a big purchase. We've been saving money, putting it aside because we want to get a playground um, set up in our backyard so we don't have to go out to parks all the time. So yeah, we try not to go to the parks as much, just um, not to live in fear, but just to be um, um, cautious, I guess. Um, if you also haven't followed my lupus journey, I'm on some medicine. My medication actually prohibits my immune system, so I, my immune system is pretty sensitive and low. So if you follow me on Instagram and I posted pictures of my outing this past week, you'll see like some of my family members on there like saying, be careful, be careful, Rue, we love you. And it's all because of this, because I have an immune compromised system. And I'm pretty important to my family. <laughs> Like I, and they're important to me. <laughs> so, um, that's our biggest thing. Looking for a purchase for our backyard and just being very cautious and going out. We still go to, of course, like the grocery store. Um, but we wear our mask and all that, all that good stuff. Um, but I really need to stay, stop saying, um, <laughs> sorry. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, back to the comments. I really love and appreciate your comments and a lot of you have been telling me just how blessed you are to be able to live on the Navajo Nation and have all of that area for your children to roam. That's incredible. That's something I know my children are definitely missing out and that's definitely a con of living in a city. You don't get to be home and have that firsthand experience. Yes, baby. What, babe? I don't know what she wants. 
she'll call my name again in a row. Yes, honey. Love you. Yeah, baby. I'm like yelling and our house carries echoes. So I'm like, what baby? And our little guy is sleeping. So I hope I don't wake him up. Yeah, I hope you guys are having a really great Sunday. If you want to see anything more about my planning and how I'm writing in our calendar, let me know. I would love to do a video on that, maybe even just show you some pictures about it. I just really want to connect with you guys, let you know I'm slow in my emails, but I'm going to get to it. Um, let you know what's been going on in our life. We got some new couches yesterday, so I'm so happy about that. Like, woo, woo. Ooh, win win you know when you're an adult is when you get happy about like the big stuff in life like two months ago and uh, a month ago when we first moved into the house we got washer and dryer combo and I like text my girlfriend and I'm like look at what we got and we're gushing about it so I hope you guys have a really good no, rest of huh? oh she wants to show you something real quick go ahead this is a mini Monopoly. <gasps> That's a mini Monopoly. Aww. And you can open it open. He has short arms. Uh -oh. My little drummer is in the back. Which is not our problem. Yes. <laughs> enjoyed our video please comment like and share bye if you haven't already subscribed subscribe and hit the bell bye